Well, Philip and Julie were both both very important to me. Julie was one of the first people I met when I started at Watson Ranch Bottom. Over the years, she was what the firm was all about, a traditional local practice that has done really well through caring for people and developing relationships, etc, etc. And Julie was the biggest work finder at that time that Watson Ramsbottom had ever, had ever had, but usually by going down to Darwin Market and meeting people at the cafe bar. So she'd come back with a new client every day because she'd met them at the cafe bar over a brew and a, over a, brew and a jam cake. Uh, over the years when I was working with Julie, so I think I was here in 2007 until she resigned in 20. 20, although she'd been here since 1976, so uh, when I, even I was only three. So I think there were many roles, and then she used to, uh, if you never needed keys caught, Julie got a keys caught. I think that I even split my trousers once, Julie mended my trousers. She was ju just knew everybody in Darwin, as I said, what the firm was all about. So, as I say, true what's well, initially Watson's, and then Watson and Ramsbottom merged in the early 2000s, and then uh, it became a proper Watson Ramsbottom legend. No, no, I have got some interest now in uh, church. I do things in church, organising stuff. So, uh, yeah, 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 but I do miss everybody. I do miss the girls, I do miss the natus. I don't miss the technology, because I hated it. But, yeah, yeah, I mean, when you think about it, I started here in 76. No computers, no nothing, manual typewriter. Um, carbon paper, stuff like that, pen and paper. So, yeah, moved up a lot over the years. So, yeah, very privileged. I have never been a celebrity before. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful. Yeah, absolutely wonderful. Thank you very much, Anton. Philip, obviously, was the uh, MD before myself, was the guy who interviewed me, who had the pleasure of interviewing the cocky, the pocky, cocky bald fella 17, 18 years ago. I got on with him straight, straight from day one and he was instrumental in the change from a firm, becoming a, a small firm with three offices to where we are today. Helped, helped me grow the conveyance department massive, instigated the first compliance team that Watson Ramsbottom and ever had and brought all the part and was instrumental in Watson's becoming Watts, Watson's, which merging with Rams Watson and Core to becoming Watson Rams Watson. Moved the company to limited company status that it enjoys now, which we've all benefited from, and oversaw the refurbishments of all the offices to the lovely ones where they are now. They weren't lovely then, they all had rips in the carpet, and they were a bit embarrassing, you didn't really want clients coming in. And uh, it was a massive part of Making it, uh, making it the place it is today. He also thinks he's me, seems to think he's my dad for some reason. I don't know why. I think he looks like Captain Manning. Well, last year we, I, when I retired, I was seventy, so um, we had a special holiday for that reason. We went to the West Indies. Then we were invited by our colleague Emily in Cyprus to her wedding, so we went to that. Then my own daughter got married. So at the end of last year, we went few and we've not done anything this year at all except you know just enjoy being away from the office really. I've been back a few times since you know just to annoy everybody and make them feel jealous about not working. Obviously it's uh, tricky when you go from you know in the middle of what there's 200 people here now plus to not 200 people it's quite a thing which is why in a way because we were so busy last year, it, it was good really, because I didn't have time to sort of sit at home and think, right, what am I supposed to do now, you know, there's a lot of stuff to do, so it's the people really, uh, you know, the hassle, well, the challenges are, you do miss them as well, to be honest, you know, the, uh, the challenges of running the practice and everything else, but yeah, I think the people is the big thing. I've been thinking back about the rooms I've been in in my career and I've never had my name on the door. Not, I was never really bothered, but when I started, the bosses all had the names on the doors, you know, uh, but I've never had it. So, yeah, delighted with it, yeah, really good.